everyone, my name is Russell Jackson, and for today I'm presenting you the Rush and Major Tomahawking Spider for trespassing. Yeah, enjoy the video. Earth Defense Force 4 is a Japanese recreation of me finding a spider in my shower. While he's learning a valuable lesson about trespassing on private property, I'm gonna remind you that this is your first and only warning that there are giant spiders in this video. Oh god. Back in June of 2017, God decided that Earth was taking up too much disk space in the solar system and chose to uninstall it by hitting select all on his worst creations and heating them into the Earth. Okay, this is a bit much, even for God. Codenamed the Ravagers, these robot alien bug lizards mean business because typically when an invader brings giant giant lizards and a literal genocide gun, they aren't looking to negotiate. Oh god, you're getting hit with the McDonald's right! Oh. Thankfully, even the wrath of god is no match for the United States, I mean Earth Defense Force, which usually responds to things that it doesn't understand by carpet bombing them out of existence. It's a bird, it's a plane, oh no, it's Lockheed Martin. But this EDF desperately needs people to pull triggers and call out coordinates, which is where you come in, playing as guy with gun, girl with gun, that can fly I guess, guy that has no gun but can call his buddy that has the biggest gun. And last but not least, I try not to look him directly in the eyes. I want my perk 30s, bitch. So if you'd like to see mankind attempt to uppercut God and all of his lizards that have absolutely no legal relation to the trademarked creature Godzilla, then I suggest you stick around. I'm gonna be honest, I don't have a permit to kill this nondescript lizard. Or you can close the video now and save yourself the Headache, because my squad and I may be the very best that the EDF has to offer, but that's not saying much. It's morbid time. <laughs> Doctor tried to give me Tylenol instead of perks, so I punched him in his fucking face. <laughs> this is what Europeans think American recess is like. <laughs> yes. Don't kaiju. This is not a. <laughs> yeah, don't worry, man. I used to eat a lot of fucking dirt this back in the day. We're ready, fellas. <laughs> <laughs> Yoink. Oh. God, that was so perfect in time. The EDF deploys. Ten seconds. Have you ever mistaken the end of mankind for a practical joke? This prank fucking sucks. My brother in Christ, you are witnessing our extinction. Welcome to EDF 4.1, and I hope you're comfortable because there are 89 missions to go. And all of them involve me getting shoved in the forever box by giant insects. I'm getting gaggle fucked by a billion ants over here. Yeah, yeah, this is going great. Suck my fucking dick. As fun as an 89 mission lore crusade sounds, EDF is better explained with flow charts. Oh boy, do I ever love flow? Basically, the Ravagers, aka God, throw something at you, you blow its head off, so they throw either a shit ton more of that thing at you, a variant of that thing at you, a bigger version of that thing at you, or make you fight that thing in the dark. Yeah, giant spider's not hard enough. Let's do this shit with our eyes closed. Then once they realize that thing isn't gonna kill you, bang, they throw in the next thing. Sometimes this graduation is logical. Like, oh, you beat all the ants? Well, here come the spiders, fuckface. You calling a satellite on that one spider? Yes. yes. Other times, it's not. Like, oh, you beat all of our robots? and lasers while well, I hope you're ready to fight the entire dragon population of Skyrim. I don't know what's happening anymore. <laughs> what's happening with my brother in Christ? You are the dragon board. Occasionally, the Ravagers break the flow chart and throw some random shit at you like, uh, nondescript lizard, uh, Don Hector. Uh, dog. What the dog do? What the dog doing? Literally dog crushing an entire metropolis. First comment. What the dog doing? But they can spam all the dipshit lagoon creatures they want because we've got something they'll never have. Yeah! Discretionary spending. In case you're unfamiliar with the final boss of planet Earth known as America, we have a yearly allocation of money approved by our head mage and council of elders, informally known as Defense Department Dima Dollars. These give us the right, but not the obligation, to send any creature on our planet back to God for any reason at any time. You can't parry that shit, you dumbass! So if the Ravagers think they can enter American airspace without consequences, I've got 778 billion reasons why they're wrong. I'm done playing with your ass, dummy. 
my God. I'm not playing with you. <laughs> to remain more accurate, it technically is the Earth Defense Force and not the United States, but it's canonically headquartered in North America and is basically a Japanese flavored NATO. Hey, isn't NATO the one that drone strikes weddings? No, that's the US. That's us. But the US is part of NATO. Yes, but you can't just blame NATO. I can't believe NATO would do something like that. US, EDF, Kawaii NATO, whatever your preferred pronoun is for the exterminators, we're the ones with the discretionary spending, and I'm about to blow 99% of it on napalm. We're just in the end of a Marlboro right now. This is what goes on inside of a Marlboro cigarette to deliver you maximum fucking flavor. 825 weapons across four different classes are at your disposal, and you can rest assured that 825 of them are fucking stupid. How much damage has Oh, oh, what? The you thruster can damage building. me? I just leveled yeah. half this building. <laughs> this is the dumbest fucking weapon on this planet. <laughs> Before picking your stupid weapon, pick your stupid class. Ranger is stupid stupid, wing diver is weird stupid, air raider is stupid overpowered, and fencer is again. Do not look him in the eyes. Every class is a solid pick because the one stupid thing they all have in common is that they're all stupid fun. That's hey, not yeah. actually a laser. That's just a big ass physics gun from Gary's mod <laughs> yes. pointed at the earth. Yes. <laughs> Ranger is Babby's first EDF class that's essentially man with gun. So if you greet household pests with a barrel of a 12 gauge, this guy is a no brainer. Watch this. <laughs> 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 I don't even want to I hope you like Backblast because you are forced to use a rocket launcher if you're playing on any difficulty higher than journalist. And the reason why is simple. S to the C to the A L E because the Ravagers have been here all of five minutes and they've already smoked half of the human race. That's not hyperbole, that's canon. Human race has been destroyed. You've got to remember how big and how many of these things there are. For the majority of the game, you can close your eyes while shooting and suffer zero decrease in accuracy. Why the fuck does EDF even have a crosshair? I don't need this shit. You're facing a mountain of insects every mission, and you move mountains with explosives. Because ARs lack firepower, shotguns lack range, sniper rifles lack rate of fire, and before one of you smart asses says missiles are superior to rockets, they're not. I'm getting my dick munched by a spider every second of every round. I don't have 20 minutes to lock onto a target and another 20 to wait for an explosion. I need that shit low tier god now. I might get it, I might get it, I might get it, I might get it, I might get it. Come on, oh I got it, I got it, you fuck, don't kill that guy. Sir, uh sir, sir. <laughs> oh my god. So if you want to play Ranger, you've got to be a rocket man. There are just too many fucking bugs for you to use anything else. Oh Seriously, man, guys, I'm at my fucking limit. Please stop spawning one. Bring the shotgun secondary is a wise choice because there is a range where rocket launchers should not be deployed. And I'm far enough. I was not far enough. You can get away with using a grenade launcher like the Splash or Stampede, blasting 30 frags per shot, but the odds of you clearing a mission without killing everyone, including yourself, is virtually zero. Let me see how this works. <laughs> I could have oh cut my god. On the ground. You can be ahead of me all you want. Be my fucking. Guy. I'm not swinging. Yeah, you literally, bro. <laughs> oh, they all came back. I don't even know where to go now. I'm. I oh god. god. Oh I'm god. Just <laughs> Wing divers are a special forces unit comprised entirely of fictional creatures called women, specifically designed as a secret weapon against giant creatures, which is why they spend all of their time getting clapped by giant creatures. Apart from an arsenal based in laser beams instead of jacketed hollow points, Wing Diver has a massive movement advantage over Ranger that she uses exclusively to get stuck in spider web. But that's okay, it's nothing that a direct impact from an M202 flash can't fix. Rangers lead the way. Also, how are you still alive? If you can avoid playing like an NPC, Wing Diver has the mobility and firepower to vaporize every last bug on this planet. Y'all, yeet. Very big if, though, because much like all women, her armor scaling sucks, so if you don't meticulously manage your ever-depleting energy levels, the insects are gonna snap you in half like a Ritz cracker. She also gets bonus points for her rollerblades and quirky weapons. Hey, yo, I can monsters. take out a whole Twilight bunch Princess. if you pick me up. Watch. Oh my god, yeah. it's just what my gun does.